Amazon is due to report fourth quarter earnings on Tuesday, the 2nd of February. Now, Amazon outperformed the rally in the markets in 2020. It benefited, benefited from huge changes in consumer spending habits and tech companies. These are the things to watch for. So all signs are pointing to a blockbuster sales over the holiday period. Also, we've got the profit outlook, which is less clear given a projected four billion US dollars in extra costs related to COVID. Third quarter operating margin was 6.4% versus 4.5% a year earlier. And this trend is expected to hold up. The outlook will also be closely eyed. Now, sales gains are expected to slow and any disappointment here could send the price lower. Although Amazon usually has a strong storage of growth initiatives. As far as the numbers are concerned, revenue is expected to come in between 112 billion US dollars and 121 billion US dollars in the fourth quarter. That will be growth of around 28 to 38 percent, whilst earnings per share is expected to come in at seven dollars per share that would be an increase of 8.2 percent year on year as far as the chart is concerned we can see here that there's been this strong run up from the the turn of the year and also from those mid march lows and it's, amazon's rallied around 55 percent across the year however what we have also seen is the rally stalled here around sort of the late summer, end of August, beginning of September. And here, since then, it's been trading very much rain, range bound, capped on the downside by at around three uh, three thousand and fifty dollars and then capped on the upside by around three thousand three hundred and fifty. Technically, the outlook is neutral at the moment and it could take the Q4 earnings as a catalyst to push the price either beyond that upper limit or a disappointing numbers could see the uh, share price drop below that lower band of 3050. For more trading videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel.